Open for Business is sponsored by Washington Federal. Good Thursday morning, everybody. Brad Good here with your Good for Business report. All right, it is annoying for passengers and quite costly for airlines. That's the word this morning from government auditors who say U.S. carriers are now experiencing computer outages nearly once a month. A government agency says there were 32 outages between 2015 and 2017, and 85% of those caused flight delays or cancellations. In 2018, American Airlines had to cancel 3,000 flights due to an outage, costing the airline $35 million. Analysts blame incompatible computer systems cobbled together after a wave of mergers. The shipping wars are heating up once again. Overnight, Target announcing it will offer same-day delivery on some 65,000 items for about 10 bucks an order. Until now, Target shoppers looking to receive same-day delivery through Shipped had to go to the startup's website and pay $99 for an annual membership or 14 bucks for a monthly membership. This week, Target incorporated the Shipped feature on its own website. It appears the June stock rally is ready to run again, even in the face of a spike in oil prices and no trade deal to end tariffs with China. Much of the tailwind on Wall Street is from the belief that the Federal Reserve will cut interest rates to keep the economic expansion on track. Meantime, U.S. import prices dropped in May and consumer prices remain tame, so this lack of inflation may also nudge the Fed to drop rates. Taking a look at the action, there it is, the Dow still putting up some muscle with a triple-digit move up about 104 points now in early trade. That's good for business. Powered by Washington Federal Bank. Invested here.